hunting today. Hopefully we can find some really cool stuff. First stop, the antique mall. Uh -huh. The lighting in here is really weird, but you never know what you're gonna find. This is where I found the Barbie with the wheelchair before the new Barbie fashionista came out. So I was like really excited. And I'm looking around right now. We got some Barbies from the 90s. Look at that Stacy with articulated knees. Come on, bring it back. Ooh, Star Trek. A vintage Malibu Barbie. Wow! Whoa, $30. Well, yeah, that's the price of vintage. We got some Disney Descendants up in here and a Yoda. What's up, Yoda? Look at those Descendants. What is the price tag on that? $30. That seems to be a very popular price right now. No way. In sync? <laughs> that is hilarious. Monster High, WW Superstars, Disney Rapunzel, Monster High again. Ooh, a Talking Bratz. I've got a lot of these dolls already. I'm not really seeing anything that I just have to have right now. Walmart! Heading straight to the toy aisle. Hopefully we will find those new Barbie fashionistas that have just been released. I have not had a lot of luck finding them lately in my area. I do see a new fashion pack. The Barbies all look the same. I have most of these already, but I don't have this one. The Barbie Sweet Orchard Farm. Oh yeah, this guy. I didn't have him for my review, so awesome. We got Jojo. Nice to see the Disney princesses on the shelf in their comfy, casual clothes. Off the hook dolls. Now I actually really like these. I don't have this one. Her outfit is adorable. And I don't think I have this one either. Loving the little tutu. My LOL surprise section is pretty sad. Kind of empty. So fresh, so fresh, so fresh, so fresh. The Fresh Dolls! Wow, there are a lot of boxy girls here. Lots and lots of Milas. Got a Hannah here. I do believe I have most of these. That's a Polly Pocket I don't have. The Dance Partay case. Love it! Disney Princesses, lots of Royal Shimmer. Ooh, and we still have some with their the full outfit. I really like that. And what? What? No way! Yo, do I see what I think I see? Right next to Harry Potter, I have Wild Hearts crew. Kenna Roswell, y'all. I have been seeing these all over Instagram and I was like, I gotta find them. And I was really, really nervous that I wouldn't find one because my stores, you know, it's like, I feel like we always get everything last here. But yes, we found them. Okay, let's see if there's any more. They are on the top shelf and <laughs> I am kind of short here. So bear with me as I try to look through the dolls. All right, there's Kenna again. We have more Kenna. So this whole row looks like a uh, Kenna, all right? And another Kenna. Whoa, look at that. We have a new one. This. Oops, they're gonna fall, don't fall. This is Cory Cruz, we found her, so that's two, yes! And the other two are also Cory Cruz, so we found two of the Wild Hearts crew. Now I just have to straighten the shelves back. I need little Froggy here, she's taller than me. Uh, Target! Wow, their toy section is fully stocked for Toy Story 4. We have lots of action figures here. There is the Barbie. Oh, look at Bullseye. Ooh, how to train your dragon toys. When these came out last time, I went ballistic over finding all of the minifigures. And that one is kind of cute. Retro Care Bears. I had every single one of these when I was little. My room was filled with them. Looks like a lot of Marvel Rising and Captain Marvel items are on sale. 
Got some little price breaks here. That's fun. Whoa! Boxy girls come in giant box rooms. This is new and it says only at Target right here on the bottom. That is awesome. I might have to grab one of these because, you know, I love my box rooms and all. That is a new character and she has furniture. And it looks like the room opens up. Yeah, we're getting this. Gure Tama Tamagotchi? Really? In the Barbie section, still not seeing new Barbies. Come on. I need those new fashionistas. Twisty pets. Color reveal hair doorbells. Our generation. Target's 18 inch doll line has some really cute things. Check out the hot dog cart. Has a chalkboard on the side and lots of little details. Can you see that? There's like pretzels and ketchup. That's really cool. Even little toppings. I don't know if my camera can see that, but then we go down and we have, what is this, Space Camp? That's pretty cool. And this looks like a horse trailer. Love my horses. Tuesday morning. I'm going to all of my favorite toy spots today because Tuesday morning is where you can sometimes find Barbies, like signature Barbies, really, really nice ones. And I'm hoping we will get lucky today. We've got Monster High. Looks like some basic five points of articulation dolls. And then a Draculaura. Then this is a Royal Academy. I'm sorry, Regal Academy. I remember seeing these at Toy Fair, but I never actually saw them in stores. At $9, they are fully articulated and come with some really cute little accessories. Aw, Beauty and the Beast doll. And we do have a Barbie fashionista right here, priced at $14. She comes with some clothes, but I am looking for some signature Barbies and I'm not seeing it. Found a Briar for $19. And whoa, the Go Tiny Room from Polly Pocket for only $14.99. That is a great price if you were interested in buying this room. The designer studio for Calico Critters. Now we do already have this, but you know, with these you can stack them so you can get more than one and build your own little town. Miraculous action figures for only $3.99. Here is Stormy Weather, Lady Wi-Fi, and yeah, that's it. Then there's like some Enchanimals in the back there. I am checking another Walmart to see if we can find more of the Wild Heart Crew dolls, Wild Hearts, Wild Hearts Crew dolls. <laughs> I always leave off S's, but hopefully we can find some more so we can have the whole set. Doll hunting really is like an all day event. Ooh, new dolls. They are fully posable and they come in little flower pots. Still no new Barbie fashionistas. Okay, I'm just gonna have to order online. Ugh. But look at that! We found some fresh dolls and the very rare Malik in stores. And the Froggy Fresh doll! I cannot tell you how awesome it is to find my doll in the store. We should probably get another one so we can change her hairstyle. I see lots of Harry Potter. Oh, this is a cute shoppy. The Beach Style series, I think they're adorable, and I don't think I have this one. She comes with a little sarong. But I am not seeing any more Wild Hearts crew here. I even asked if there were any in the back, and they were like, no, not yet. So I guess we have to keep looking. Wait a minute, I see something. I think that is one of the National Geographic dolls. Yes! This is such a cool collection, and she comes with a little monkey. Is that a journal in the top? Ha! <laughs> Love it! Trying another Tuesday morning. I am determined to find some really awesome Barbies today. Okay, this one is definitely looking a little more promising. I do see another Regal Academy doll. This is different than the one we saw earlier. And I see some Skipper dolls. And look at that! It is the Happy New Year Holiday Hostess collection, and she's got on a really pretty gold dress. Look at that. 
They've got a Wrinkle in Time doll for $29.99. They came out at $50. And whoa, look at her. This is the Luciana Barbie doll from the Global Glamour Collection. Her face is beautiful. Look at those curls. Priced at $49.99. Originally $100. But, you know, we're going to have to rebody her. We need a maid to move body. I think she's a keeper. I am at my last Walmart. Been doll hunting for quite a while. It's been like, like three and a half hours. Yeah, it's been like an entire day. So uh, this is the last stop. Hopefully we'll find some more dolls here. <sighs> okay, here we go. Do we see new Barbies? That is a no. I see Snapstar, Party Pop Teenies, Make Your Own Forky Kits. These are only $3.88. That is a great price. You can make your own Forky, but I am not seeing any more Wild Hearts Crew dolls. So technically, it's not even the release date yet. I believe I saw that online. They're not even due out until July 7th. So if you find them now, that's like, yay, because you're getting them early. But uh, I had to try, and we found two, so that was, that's a success. I'm actually pretty happy with that. Wait a minute. I just asked someone if there were any more in the back, and so he went to go check to see if they had some on hand, because he ran the little SKU number that I got off of Instagram. Thank you for everyone who's posting that. And uh, let's see. While waiting, we can take a look at some new shoppies. This is Berry Delish, Num Nom's Melty Pops. What is this? Um, it has a whole bunch of rules. It says, do not shake, do not poke, do not flip. Well, of course we have to do that now. All right, well, nothing happened there. It does say, try me, so let's see. Oh, it's, it's yelling at me. Okay, shh, shh, be quiet. Oh, he's back. No! He said there aren't any in the back, and so we're just gonna have to wait a little bit longer to expand our collection. But we did find two, so yay. I think we got a couple of really good finds this trip from our Well Hearts crew to our Barbie signature dolls and that Boxy Girl set from Target. Yay! Yeah. You can expect to see some of our finds in upcoming Unbox Dailies. Thank you for joining us while we did a little doll hunting. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to ring the bell and follow us on Instagram at MyFroggyStuff and the Frog Vlog. And we will see you next time. Bye!